Hey YouTube, called Game Now. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a VPN, a virtual private network, on your PlayStation 3. So the first thing you have to do is buy a um, virtual private network, a VPN. Um, in this case, I'm using private internet access. You may be able to use a free one. Um, I wouldn't recommend it for bandwidth and just reliability. Um, they're not that dear. My one that I'm using, I'm using $40 a, a year, which is not that bad at, at, at all, really. Um, if you can afford it, then get it. Um, pretty much, then what you have to do, you got to connect it. So, I can connect to, connect to whatever country you want to mask your IP, put the VPN on. And for this example, I'm using Sydney, which has um, got the most bandwidth at the moment. Um, and then you gotta once you've connected that you gotta right click on your internet here and you're gonna wanna um, go to open network and sharing and then you're gonna want to go to change it um, uh, change adapter settings sorry um, your VPN would be um, it's called a tap um, tap adapter v9 so it's it? this one Local area connection too. This, this is my one. You gotta look up tap Windows adapter V9, which is your VPN. And your other one that you're gonna need is your actual um, Ethernet or Ethernet, whatever you wanna call it. Um, in. So you gotta wanna connect that from an, a um, LAN cable um, from your computer that you're using in this case I'm using a laptop to the back of your PlayStation 3. Um, first thing we do is you want to bridge your actual internet, so your your Ethernet, to over towards your VPN. So um, your VPN can run through your internet. So pretty much all you have to do is right click on your VPN, which is the tab Windows Adapter V9. Right click it, go Properties. Then you go sharing, and you want to allow other networks users to correct uh, to connect through this um, computer's internet connection. Um, you want to select your your um, your laptop's Ethernet. In your case, it's probably called local area connection. I had to find mine. My one's called Internet. It's probably it's probably going to call um yours probably will be called Family Controller, which what mine's called um. You want to allow network users to connect to this, and you want to um, select whatever you're using. Um, you want to press OK, save it, and you want to jump over to your PlayStation. Really easy. You want to go to Network Connection Settings, or um, Network Settings, and you want to go Internet Connection Settings. And once you're Internet Connection Settings, you want to go Custom. And when you're in custom, you want to keep going, just keep pressing, uh, once you're in custom, sorry, you want to go to wired, you want to keep pressing right until you go test connection. Um, when you're in test connection, you don't have to, um, test the connection, you can hop out of it and try and sign in. Hopefully it will sign in. Um, sometimes when it doesn't sign in, I have to play around with mine, I have to just keep playing around with it, disconnecting the LAN cable, connecting it so it can try and find it and stuff. And um, I eventually got mine working. Mine works fine. Fine. For you RTM guys, so if you have a jailbroken PlayStation, you can connect it. Yes, up. But you can connect to Kex and Dex through this. You just have to um, get the IP on your PlayStation and put it over to your um, Dex and Kex. So normally set set it up. Um, hopefully it worked for you guys. If it did. Put a thumbs up, um, rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next video. See you later.